This video is about how to multiply complex numbers. Okay, there's three ways you can multiply. You can use FOIL, you can use the box method, or you could just use distribution if it's a simple enough problem. So remember your complex numbers have a real part and an imaginary part to each. So if this is the situation, this is one where you would use box or FOIL. Example one, however, is one where you would just simply have to distribute. In this case, distribute a four. So let's do that. Four times negative two is negative eight. Four times three is 12. And the I stays there. There's nothing I can do to reduce this, simplify it. That's all I had to do was simply distribute. Example two, okay? These are complex. So I'm gonna have to use FOIL or box. So I use FOIL, but if you wanna use box, that's fine. First terms would give me an eight. Outer terms would give me a plus six i. Inner terms, negative i times four will give me negative four i. And negative i times three gives me negative three i squared. So let's simplify this. Six i minus four i is two i's. And remember what i squared is, negative three times a negative one. That's what i squared is, so eight plus two i this becomes a plus three. So my final product is one, I'm sorry, my final answer is 11 plus two i. Try this one. First terms is a nine. Outer terms, three times negative two is negative six i. Inner terms, positive six i. Last terms, negative four i squared. Okay, look, negative six i plus six i cancels out. So what I have is nine minus four times negative one, which is really nine plus four, which we all know is a 13. One more example. What if it says three plus two i squared? Remember, that is three plus two i times three plus two i. Do not tell me that, that answer is nine plus four i squared. That is not correct. You have to, you have to spread them out do foil or box, okay? When I do my foil, three times three is nine. Outer, I get six i. Inner, six i. Last terms, four i squared. So let's simplify, nine plus 12 i plus four times negative one. Four times negative one is negative four. Oh, I forgot my i right there. Nine minus four is five plus 12 i. There it is. There's my solution. Okay, so things to remember as you're doing this. Remember, if it's a complex number being squared, you have to write it out. A plus bi times a plus bi, box or foil. If you're multiplying square roots, remember what gets under the square root gets multiplied by what's under another square root. So you will see that on some of the problems today. I squared, remember, is just negative one. So always simplify it. Do not leave I squared in your answer. Go ahead and simplify. All right, for the whisk, I want you to do this problem and put your answer in the whisk for me. Hopefully um, this makes sense. If not, bring your questions to class. Thank you.